Uh, hello everyone, and welcome to quite possibly the first member's quest I've ever done for the quest through. Uh, this is done using my main account, uh, Aguila77, titled Sir. Anyway, today we're going to be doing Devious Minds. To begin, talk to that monk out front, out front of this temple here. You'll recognize it because it's on the very, very edge of Varrock. Or just that edge of that pathway leading from Varrock, past whatever it is from that one place. That one rift, basically. Um, most people should know what I'm talking about if you've ever gone into Mortania. Anyway, um, pausing for a brief bit, I'll explain what we need to do with these three items in my inventory later. Unpause. Alright, Grace, I'm recording again. Alright, well, here's a friend for your viewers, and you, kind of. What? Oh, I'm saying the file to you, so, so it'll be much, a better experience. Alright, I'll just record that as like a last bit and upload it separately, alright? No, you won't. Yes, I will. Alright, you know what? Screw it up. <sighs> F3, on pause. Right, so after a random bit, or just... I don't know what to call that. Anyway, it's... Just deviation from the usual. What that monk had wanted you to do, well, the dialogue was skipped over because I began this ages ago and only just now I got the smithing level to do it, is he wants you to take this mithril two-handed sword and then grind it down using Doric whetstone and then attach a bowstring to it. What I find interesting is that... See that on his workbench? Examine. There's a wolfbane dagger here. What could Doric want with this? Yes, that's a dagger for killing werewolves. And I mean like the literal, we'll rip you limb from limb werewolves, not Twilight, the boring werewolves. The, the shortest ones. Accompanied an embassy into Mortania, and after that I... Okay, so apparently Doric's been to Mortania. I never knew that. Alright, anyway, you take this and use it on this whetstone. Basically, all you'll have to do is ask Doric for permission. Wait, this. What's his name? Doric. D O R I C. I thought, I thought I said Doric. I was like, wait, what? In before whale penis jokes. Anyway, what you get from that is a slender blade. Use the bowstring with this, and it creates a bow sword. And anyway, I'm pausing to return to the monk. Anyway, no, is it just me, or that me that seems like a very popular name in Christmas movies? Carol. Carol. Yeah. You've got a point. I've, <clears throat> I've seen like three today with main women with that name. Wow. Play on words, perhaps. Uh, anyway, back on track. Once you've made your uh, bow sword. Oh shit, sorry about that. I'm a mild bit congested. Always seems to happen when I'm in my room for some reason. And whenever I'm trying to record or edit, that's retarded. You edit? Z yeah, for post commentary. Anyway, the only reason I have this is because I get the feeling I know I'm supposed to go to Entry now or something like that. Anyway, bow sword in hand, talk to this monk. Or, back here. Have you brought the weapon for me? Uh, yeah, can you teach me how to use it? It's a foreign design. Maybe later one of our warriors will show you how it's used. Speaking of which, may I have it, please? Yep. Got it right here for you. Ah, excellent. This won't be forgotten. You've been a great help, though I wonder if you could do me one final favor. Wait, this sounds familiar. What are you talking about? I just need you to make a delivery to Entrina for me. There's a special ceremony, which unfortunately I can't attend, and I want to give you them and I want to give them a gift to mark the occasion. Ominous much? Okay, let's do this then. Pass me the present. <clears throat> Not so fast. It's supposed to be a surprise, so you'll need to sneak onto the island. Here, there's some kind of other realm or some such which you can get at, which you've got access to. You mean the abyss? 
Yes, that's the one. Now take this orb and put it in one of the large pouches from there. Don't want it getting damaged. Hmm. Into dusting. Cabbage port. The only reason I'm... Reason? Hmm. Grayson, you've gone quiet on me. <coughs> I'm watching a video. <laughs> oh, that explains it then. Right. Don't want to interrupt your recording. Never mind. Or do I? Or do I? You just said, or do I, twice. You know that, right? No, I didn't. What? No, I didn't. Damn it, Skype. <laughs> Go back to my video now. Read me, hollow really loudly. Or use a chat. Sorry, but I clearly can't type. Oh. It's just like my fingers are all bent back. Well, then you better scream very loudly. Type it with my nose. Oh my god. <laughs> no, it's just like parents open the door, look in, slowly draw back out with that sort of like, what's it called? The whole pull in, pull out thing? No, it's not sex, by the way. It's a. <laughs> it's that one <laughs> instrument that does the whole doop sort of sounds. Oh no! Oh, I um, I know it's something. They mentioned it on SpongeBob. Slide whistle or something like that. Yeah, the slide whistle. It just has that sound effect with them just quickly withdrawing back. Yeah. <laughs> don't, don't ask how I know that that name. What slide whistle? Yeah. <clears throat> I think it has something to do with Spongebob. <laughs> yes. Well, shit, looks like I can't use a wicked hood to teleport in. So... Stupid. I won't be quiet, you. <clears throat> Going back to my video. You do that. Anyway, I'll catch a... Catch a fairy ring teleport to Entrina. Er, Edgeville, rather. Since it's not much of a walk, I'm going to be taking you people through this. Because it's not exactly all over RuneScape. It's sort of like a short jot. <coughs> so, oh, crap. Sorry, I had to clear my throat there. And God, this video is... Sorry, RS seems to be lagging. Ordinarily, it's smoother than this for me. There we go. Oh, crap. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, by the way. Like the new look. Sorry, I've just... Oh my god, there's actually people here. So I'm just running out of things to talk about, so I'm trying to find things to talk about. Because, you know. Have to have, like, travel talking. I don't know what I'm talking about, I apologize. Is that Tutorial Island over there? Let me check the map. One moment, sorry to put you people through this. I'm very sorry. Dude, it is... My god. I wonder how Tutorial Island looks with the new graphics. Sorry, I just had like a nerd nostalgia gasm right there. <laughs> Sorry. I for this game, it's Tutorial Tutorial Island holds a lot of memories for me. After all, it's where I, it's where I uh, got my start from Tutorial Island. It's where just about everybody got their start from. And by God, did I love it. I didn't actually know at the time that you could level everything that you could train there to three before you got off, which would put you leaps and bounds ahead of everybody that didn't. Not necessarily leaps and bounds, but a small bit above, unless you quickly lost interest in the game or something. 
For me, it's what Tutorial Island is what got me into it. Anyway, this loads. Oh, that's right. The Edgeville teleports right next to the Grand Exchange, which is extremely populated. So is Edgeville. I just realized I'm gonna have to go through the long way, all the way around. Well, the abyss will be an interesting bit, so I'll record, so I'll keep that in. If I feel like I need to make any edits, I'll just do some um, jump cuts in Movie Maker. I hope. I'm not going to. Yeah, I may push myself because Grayson kicked me, in, pretty much kicked me into drive with that. So instead of constantly hitting F3 on Hypercam, I can just do like a proper jump cut and then save that and save whatever was cut out as an outtake. Hmm. Sorry. Why must I always do stuff like this at 10 or so? When I'm slightly tired and want to yawn. Sorry, people. I'm an idiot. I really am. Hello. I say the Wilderness Wall's gotten an update. Stylish new look. Yes, enter the wilderness. The only reason I don't have that disabled is in case I accidentally misclick and jump on through there. So I want the warning notification for the wilderness there. It's just a thing. I've never gotten what that whole trail of money thing is about anyway, by the way. See those coins? Never gotten what that was about. Anyway, teleport! And welcome to that abyss, a.k.a. hell. People have been known to die in this place. And, like that, and you will be sculled upon entrance. You pretty much have to find your way in. And from this, I must find my way. The only reason I'm doing this is because it's a fairly easy free-to-play quest. The list itself is experienced, but I think that's only because um, it needs to be. Ah, there we are. The Law Rift. So this is what the law altar looks like. Interesting. Hmm. Sorry everyone, I've never actually been to the law altar before. <laughs> 